welcome to an episode of... <laughs> welcome. We both just finished up a training session. Uh, Matt did a little cardio and some curls. And I, obviously. Obviously. And I did some Olympic weightlifting. And we thought it would be fun to do some would you rather or newlywed questions and see how our answers match up. I don't know if we're keeping score or not, but I think I can win. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Na name one band from the 70s. The entire Days and Confused album. That's what I listened to, the soundtrack. Are they from the 70s? I think so. Fact check. I'll Google it. I add like one new song to my playlist once every four months. I listen to Kit Moore and then like, that's basically it. I got some Post Malone in there. What else is on there? I got some Jelly Roll. The most recent song I added was Bone Thugs and Harmony. Yes. Mm. Leonard Skinner, 1973. War, 1975. Kiss, 1975. Oh, okay, those are some Alice good bands. Coo Alice Cooper, 1972. ZZ Top, 1975. Ted Nugent, 1975. Okay. All right, your choice isn't bad. Yeah. Obviously. Obviously. Dude, luxury hotels are overrated. You end up just laying in bed, eating chicken fingers, watching Netflix. It's literally what I do at home. And the bed's not as comfortable. Don't be ashamed. I feel like an idiot, but yeah. Reading is hard. Yeah. It takes energy. It's just slow. I'm just so slow. It's like, I want to know the story now. How does it end? If I'm just sitting down to relax, I don't want to have to think. You do the thinking for me. Forrest Gump, Goodwill Hunting, The Town. Shot Collar. Shot Collar and Lawless. Wrong Missy. The Wrong Missy. I, I want both of these. All right, we good? Only have one. You good? We good? One. Three, two, one. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my God, having a key that opened any door. I love though that you had to think about that one. Like the jail thing never even crossed my mind of like, what's gonna happen? Like, why am I gonna go to jail? No, I don't need that. Like, like I'm just curious as <laughs> I just wanna know what, what's behind that door. Oh, I can just open really? it. Curiosity is the reason you want the key? Yes. Oh, I immediately went to theft. Line? Yeah. Well, okay, that makes sense. I don't like, mind like driving, being in the car, you got your music on, the windows open, whatever. I'm in no rush. I've never, like I genuinely have zero road rage when I'm driving. I'm like, just super chill. <laughs> Not this guy. On the other hand. <laughs> oh. I want to write teleport, but I'm not 100% sure how to spell it. Is it like it sounds? Is it, what is the origin? Is it teleport or tell a uh, port? <laughs> Two, one. Oh, good. We spelled it the same. So even if it's wrong, we're great. We're in it together. <laughs> Teleporting, you have, you can have like 80% of the benefits of being invisible. It's like if you want to spy on someone, it's like you envision hiding under their desk and boom, you're there. Mm -hmm. And then you can zip away or like hide in the closet, wh whatever it is. But then you also never have to get on another plane again. I, that would be lovely. And if I can skip TSA and never have another layover, oh. my life would be complete. Ready? Two, one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That sounds exciting. 
every Monday, it's an adventure. I just think about the my favorite episode. Yeah, of always, sunny always sunny. As it's Frank. a day in the life of Frank. It's like I could live that. Three, two, one. Yeah, easy. Uh oh. It's okay. I misspelled a whisper. It's okay. I pretty much yell all the time anyways, and Matt's always like. That's only that's only like when I first wake up mm -hmm. because you've already been up for three hours. You're two coffees deep. I'm just excited that and I'm you're not awake. a morning person. <laughs> so it's like when I come out and I sit at the at the counter, and then you're like, oh my God, you're awake. We've done so many things. Let's let's talk about it. And I'm like, oh shh. What? Oh my god. You want god. a paper cut? It's like, it's a sliver of a thing that happens. Are you kidding <sighs> me? When you stub your toe, it's like my whole Dude, body feels of it. anyone, ah. you, every time you squeeze a line with a paper cut, you're, you're f <laughs> Way better than the feeling of stubbing my toe. Oh. Stubbing my toe, I, the last time I cried was because I stubbed my toe. Like, that is not fun. You feel it up your whole body. This is like, eesh. Just Oof. the thought of a paper cut. Oh my God. Just like, Ugh. I know, I know what you're gonna answer. Do you? Oh yeah. You're right in coma for sure. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Really? <laughs> I look at it as like, I can make some friends. I might get a little tough, whatever. But like, you still have contact to the outside world. You still know what's happening. You can learn a new skill. You can, I don't know. Learn a new skill, like how to make like, prison like wine, <laughs> toilet wine. Yeah. <laughs> Make my toothbrush into a shiv. Yeah. I'd have, I'd make some friends, I assume. Wh I mean, is this is. like max security? Or are we talking like, you know, county jail here? Cause this is like. So low level prison. Low level prison you're taking is all prison. I got in me. Three. Yeah. Yeah. You don't have the foresight to pause. Like think about all the stupid shit you did in high school. It's like, you never, you never thought enough to pause, but then you did something and you were like, oh, wish I could take that back. I, I did this literally for like investing, investing in gambling. <laughs> That's the only reason. <laughs> like, dude, if you could go back to the day and be like, like Forrest Gump, like, oh, I invest in some fruit company. Yeah. Now we don't need to worry about money no more. And then like sports gambling, like, I mean, we're basically living back to the future. Or to relive really special moments. Yeah, that too. One, two, three. What? <laughs> Why would you want to be an adult? Oh my gosh, think about, okay, your flamethrower for instance. Think about you get to, as an adult, have all of the things your 12 year old self wanted and wasn't either able to afford, yeah, but allowed to use. Dude, we made Molotov cocktails. Okay, well we lived a kid. very different childhoods like, and I think adulthood is dope. But as a kid, you have no responsibilities. Someone just gives you shelter. Someone just gives you food. They just give you a home and then you, they love you unconditionally and you just go out and do whatever the f you want to do. I have to occasionally make meals on my own. Oh. Oh. I have to reheat my own meals sometimes. Oh. The microwave is so hard. Don't like when it. <laughs> when it's a new microwave. Don't like it. <laughs> 